Isla Fisher has revealed why she and Sasha Baron Cohen have kept their three children out of the limelight. Despite being two of the biggest names in Hollywood, the couple who married in 2010 have lived a relatively private life and only share brief insights with people. But while most famous people often decide to share their lives on social media and reality TV, the pair made a conscious decision not to do this for one special reason. Speaking candidly, Isla explained that she hoped her children, Olive, Delula, and Montgomery, would be able to live as much of a normal life as possible. During an appearance on ITV's Lorraine, she explained, it's unfair on them. Kids deserve a normal childhood, I want them to be outdoors and play and run around, not feel self-conscious. Instead, Isla often treats her one. 9 million Instagram followers to behind-the-scenes snaps of her glamorous life as well as snaps taken as she goes about her daily life, including walks with her beloved dog, Maisie. Meanwhile, Sasha who boasts one. 2 million followers on the photo sharing app rarely gives any insight into his personal life apart from the odd post celebrating his wife, with his last being in February for Isla's birthday. But this isn't the first time she has opened up about her life as a mother, telling Marie Claire Australia, Motherhood is actually my favorite topic but I keep it private. I think all parents are trying to protect their kids, especially in the social media age. The confessions of a shopaholic actress went on to add, I want our children to have a normal childhood being able to play outside without pressure or scrutiny. All kids have the right to just be kids, and I would never sell a film or magazine by speaking about mine. Isla has been open about her parenting in recent years, admitting that being an actress comes in handy when it comes to bedtime stories as she's able to put on a completely different voice in order to relax their children. She also explained that rather than traditional bedtime stories, Isla will use scenarios her children are experiencing including difficulties at school. In a bid to escape the drama surrounding America during Donald Trump's controversial presidency, the family left Los Angeles and moved to Sydney in 2020, with an insider rejecting claims they had hoped to escape the coronavirus pandemic. Speaking to the Sydney Morning Herald, an insider stated, they didn't want to raise their kids in Trump's America, 